Hi, today I've got a MacBook Air 13 inch and it will not turn on. So I've tried the usual troubleshooting things, you know, power management and whatnot. And since you can't take the battery out of these, like you used to be on the old Macs, I'm going to have to take it apart. And there's screws around the edge, very small screws. Um, then I'm going to have to take that apart and see what's wrong inside. All right, let's get started. You can see there's screws around the entire edge. These two on the back side hinge are longer. The rest are really small. So I'm now going to remove those. So you can grab the back side where the hinge is. is a good little part. And that comes right off. And you can see the batteries. And right here's the cable I was talking about where you disconnect it. It's right here. Okay. Now they've got the bottom off and I've unplugged the batteries. Um, I'm just going to put the bottom on, not screw it in because you got to make these point, these contact points, they're springs and they go on these points here. The laptop won't turn on unless you do that. So snap that back in, flip that over, open her up, plug the adapter in. The light comes on. See, before the light wasn't even coming on. Okay, now let's hear the moment of truth. Press the power. I shall let you see that. And bingo, it comes on. And I don't know if you can see. I don't want to pull the bottom. But you can see there's the Apple logo, so it's booting up. I'm going to let it get to the login screen and then shut her right back down. And there it is. Just as I suspected, it was in what I call a, a deep sleep. And you, you needed to remove the battery like in the old days. I know with the iPhones and with the laptop, they say you do not need to do that or you're not required to do that, but you can just do a key command. Well. I didn't actually show you that, but I've tried that and that did not work. I had to actually unplug the battery, or hence like the old time, remove the battery. Alright, so now I'm going to plug the batteries back in. And we'll put the bottom back on and try turning it on just one last time before I put all the screws back. Okay, put the battery in and There we go. And I've got the screen again. So it's working. So I'm going to put the screws back in and she's good to go. Okay, so I hope you've enjoyed the video and it helped you out if you have a MacBook, uh, MacBook or MacBook Pro or MacBook Air. Um, if you have this issue where it won't turn on, you're probably going to have to take that bottom off, unplug the batteries, plug them back in, and you'll be good to go. All right, thanks for watching.